So I'm going to take you through the whole process where I cook, how I time my oven and everything. So I just thought about this. I'm making pork and I thought why not involve you guys. So for something different, I'm actually marinating my pork. How is this camera? Come on, come down, calm down, calm down. There we are. So this is the marination. I've put this, how do you call this? Ginger. And this, how do you call it? Saumo. I don't know how how is Saumu called in English. So that so you constantly wash wash your hands. So we have pork strips here. Very nice strips. So I've already salted these. These ones are remaining, so I want to salt them. So I'm going to do it very quickly. So this is the way I salt. Um so I'm going to take you through the whole process where I cook how I time my oven and everything. So this is the other side that has never been shown to the world. You guys are the first ones to see. Now that it's the weekend, why not, right? So I'm putting some iodized salt. And this is the last one. So I'm going to put some pepper too. And after that, we are going to let it marinate slowly. So I have two types. I have this and this. So this is um, just crushed red pepper and this is black pepper. I'm also going to apply some mixed spice. So here we go. I've done this before and it turned out okay. So I'm just going to do what I did before. like applying it even like this so it's going to sink all the way in when I when I'm cooking I don't want to apply so much so that it doesn't bore the person who will be eating of course it's either me or her and whoever will decide to turn up we will welcome them we love visitors even though there's been COVID but we still love visitors and after this I'm going to put it in the fridge cover it 30 minutes so that all these flavors sink in I'm, going, I'm only going to apply one side if I, if I apply both sides it will be too much So then I'm going to cover it. So I'm going to put it in the refrigerator for some like 30 minutes as I do some other things. Then I'll preheat the oven at some degrees like 450. Then we're going to put it there for like an hour. Guess what? She's here and I'm not done. <laughs> and he's not done. So anyway, we are going on. So it joined in the surprise. Yeah, so you can see this is what we have um, done some modification. This is where the, all the pork will go. So I'm going to make some holes here that the liquid can sit down.
So we are going to wait for the oven preheat. to preheat. It. So when it's ready, we'll slot it in. Yes. Yeah. So we'll show you what we've done. So so far, this is how everything looks. We have 15 minutes left, but who are we? We are African children. We have to check. <laughs> we don't believe that things are cooking. How does it look? It looks like we need to pull it out and see what it, uh, how it actually looks. We want to see it. Yeah, we need to see it, John. Look. Ooh, yeah, now I can see. So you give it another 15 minutes. Mm. The remaining 15 minutes, we yeah. know it is okay, it is doing what it's supposed to do, so we are happy. Mm -hmm. Well, we are. Okay. Thank you. So let's do this. Taste it. And that's how you make it. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope someone now knows how to make pork, right? Yes. Are you happy? Mm -hmm, very happy. Yes. Thank you. Mm. This is what I should be doing so that you give me more hugs like this. <laughs> I cook more meat. Yeah. But yeah. Mm. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So, like we always say. And in the meantime, yeah. life and laughter with someone. Oh.